Let's understand the difference between the terms snow, sleet, freezing rain and rain. Let's say I have a surface here. You have the snow that is falling and you have a constant cold section of air that is present. So ultimately when the snow reaches the surface, it would be in a frozen form and that is what is snow. What is the difference here is between the sleet and the freezing rain that's very important. What happens in the case of sleet is you have the snow or the condensed form that could be seen in the upper airs. You have an intermediate warm air parcel. So in that, that snow converts into water but it again freezes into the cold air section. It freezes much above the ground and finally when it's falling onto the ground, it's in the form of snow. But this section, because it had been melted here and it's refreezing, it's known as sleet. Freezing rain on the other hand is very similar to sleet. The only difference is there is a warm air parcel which is intermediate but this warm air parcel is too big and the freezing takes place very close to the surface of the earth and just before touching the ground it freezes and therefore it's known as a freezing rain. Finally, you have the rain where you have no freezing that takes place and it basically pours on in the melted form. So these are four important form of precipitation. Many of the times the students are confused between the difference between the freezing rain and the sleet. So here we have a kind of simple method to help you understand. Stay tuned for more lectures. Do subscribe.